Good morning. Good morning. It's all in the plan. Where's the lion? I wanted a lion. Good. Fuck's sake. So somehow, I don't know how, Pip managed to get through slash over the gate. Um, because it was closed when I came back down and Crackle was whimpering to try and get through. That was really weird. I, I heard like footsteps coming up the, the stairs, but it sounded weird and fast. And then I heard footsteps in my room and I was like half asleep, so I was like, what's going on? I turned around and I couldn't see anyone in my room and I was terrified there was like a ghost. And then Pip jumped up. <laughs> oh dear. It would have been nice. Um, for her to be in my bed and Cracker to be in my bed if Cracker came up, but I'm allergic to like their, their hair a little bit, so unfortunately yeah, I had to push push Pip away, come downstairs instead, so I can be all allergic down here. It is a beautiful day today, uh, where I don't have much planned, um, I feel like I'm, I might be doing something later on, I, I actually can't remember, I'm really tired right now, it's only like half nine. But I have been invited around to, to Jack's house to go and clear out his his house in Frackle, just go spend a bit of time with him. So I might take him up on that offer, but I do need to be around for the dog for a bit. Just spent a little bit of time um, trying to sort out sweepstakes for the, the family. Like yesterday, um, we have a, like our own little sweepstake where we just get given a team and then we hope that they uh, do well. We've also done a pr we're also going to do a predictor sweepstake. So I found this awesome thing online, which is this whole like predictor basically. So you fill in your, what you think is going to happen and then it basically sorts out all your points for you and then you copy it over to this page and then in this one you can uh, determine how many points you get for each prediction you get right and stuff. I think it's a really, really cool, cool system. I'm hoping that people actually want to do this. I keep annoying myself really badly. Every time I want to get a t-shirt out, I keep going to that bottom drawer because at university, my fourth, the fourth drawer, the bottom drawer, was one where I kept all my, my fucking t-shirts. But now I'm at home, the t-shirts are here because I do things in the logical order. I do underwear and then t-shirt and then trousers slash shorts and then sports. Like, it makes sense, that order. Why am I an idiot and keep reaching down there? Fucking hell, I'm stupid. Oh, hey, I told you I was only going to be a couple of minutes. Where are you? Where are you? Hello? Pops? Where have they gone? They're in their cages. I didn't see them. Oh! <laughs> Hello, sweetheart. Hey, buddy. You okay? Hello. Enjoying the sun, are we, Pip? Beautiful. Sam knew how to flush the toilet after he'd had a shit. Disgusting! It's still a lovely day outside, but I'm waiting around for Ellie because I want to walk the dogs, but she's she's nowhere to be found. I cry every time. Hello? Who's that? Whose fluffy bum is that? Look at Wag. Look how happy he is. Does he want to play? Do you want to play? Oh, he wants to play, does he? Oh, I'm going to win now. I'm the best at playing there is. Come on, give it to me. Give it to me. This isn't fair. I'm battling a dog with my weedy arms. Why is he so strong? Ready? Fly backwards. Oh, he didn't fly backwards. I surprised you. Finding this really funny when Cracker pulls the toy, it makes him, he wiggles first, and then my arm does like the worm, and it like carries down entire, down our entire body, so he goes first, and it goes down me, like that, he's so <laughs> silly, he can make me dance, this is how Cracker dances, <laughs> <laughs> so weird, what the hell, is he gonna win, <sighs> he did it, what brave boy, Clearly didn't just throw Cracker's toy right at Pip by accident. I'm an idiot. Ellie's on her way now, so it shouldn't be too long before I can take them out for a well-deserved long walk up around the fort and uh, and back. Well, it's not a fort anymore. It's now just a big puddle of disappointment and new development. So. Sad. I heard you were going to be a 
you press play. <laughs> Didn't press play, I pressed record, silly. Wow, that's rude. Who's ready? Who's ready for a walk? Are you? Yes, are you? Probably. <laughs> she is. She needs to work off that tummy. Not she has a tummy, but she, you've eaten. You're I quite full. I feel so sick. Right, let's, let's just get going then. Sort you out. As well as these two weirdos. Oh, my two bitches. I'm a right hand man. Oh, is that a squirrel? No, it's a blackbird. Come on, buddy, you're doing so well with your little polly paw. Hey, what a beautiful evening. Look at this. Look how beautiful it is. It's so pretty. So are you. You look so handsome. And so are you. And it's so full. And so are you. Where they go? There they are. Come on, guys. Good boy. Good girl. In between, go whoosh. Wow, that, they stopped, brilliant. Are you gonna be okay running, Ellie? I mean, you, you couldn't finish the run yesterday. You were full. Well, that too, but also that you couldn't finish the run yesterday. Well, we're gonna finish one tomorrow, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> Poor Cracket, his little paw is hurting again, so we've decided to shorten our route somewhat, so we're not going around the fort, we're just going through through the fields and then back home. I mean, it doesn't show like it doesn't look like he's hurting that much, but if you look closely, his front right paw he lifts off the ground quite a lot, and it's bleeding a bit. So better go easy on the little guy. Anyway, it's, it's a nice evening for walking with you, isn't walking it? With me? Yeah. Aww. Like I walk with them a lot. I don't walk with you as much. Like we went on a walking holiday, yeah, but it's always oh. nice walking back here, yeah. or walking midway through a run like we were meant to be running, but you make me walk. How long have you been asleep for? An hour and a half. An hour and a half? Oh my. Well, what a numbskull. In the meantime, I've done my predictions for the World Cup uh, sweepstakes that we're doing as a fam. And uh, played football and frisbee with the dogs. Sorry I didn't film it, but I can't film me playing sport. It just doesn't work very well. Hello, baby. You okay, Z? No. You tired? Blink once if you're tired. She blinked once. She's more tired than you. Your face looks so pink. Meh, it's like you've run a mile. Oh, it's dinner time. Got some roast beef, some potato chippies, and lots and lots of veg. You've got lots and lots of veg, potato chippies, and Veggie sauce. Veggie sauce? Veggie sauce. Oh, veggie sauce. <laughs> it's a balti, which you've already had today, in a pie. <laughs> in a balti in pie form. Or it might have been a booner. Something beginning with B. The booty hole. But yeah, let's go upstairs, enjoy our food. And uh, look, look at their belly. Hello. And <laughs> that was a horrible face. And <laughs> watch something fun. Let's go here. Eat exercise time, boys. Which means it's time to get lots of hot and sweat and exasperation in on my face. It's this size time, I fell asleep. Um, and all in preparation for World Cup Day, which is uh, the following day. Look forward to that tomorrow. I got very excited about the World Cup and I am still excited for the World Cup. I'm just, I'm just so thrilled. Um, but yeah, that's the end of the vlog. I hope you did enjoy uh, my doggy day. If you did, make sure you leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and that way you'll see every single day of my life, all the events I get up to, with my dogs, with my family, with my friends, with Ellie, my boo, and uh, there's a plane. Oh, I can't film it, it's gone past the window now, it's annoying. <sighs> Life's hard. Uh, but yeah, I hope you did enjoy, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next daily video. Uh, and until then, make sure you stay safe, and have a good day. Cheerio!